What's up, guys? Bstanko6. We're going to talk about marking latitude and longitude from your radio messages to your map. Okay, so now I use real navigation, so I have this mark. I'm going to try and figure out where I'm at, even though this mark is here, and it shows exactly where I'm at. I'm going to use this as a visual aid for you so we can figure out how to properly and accurately show where we're at or whatever convoys or contacts there are. So this is my nautical chart tool. Yours is different. If you if you haven't modded it yet, then it's not going to look like this one, but it's the same thing. It's no different. Uh, this one I got out of the download mods. Um, you can get this, you know, obviously it's subsim. So stretch it, and we're going to mark... Or make sure that they're sitting properly on all the lines, which it is. You can stretch it until all the black lines are on the latitude longitude. Now, let's hover over this. I'm at 58 degrees, 57 minutes north, 2 degrees, 59 minutes west. What people get messed up is they go usually the wrong direction. All right? So I'll, I'll show you what I mean. At 58 degrees, which is right down here, this is the line, and this is 2 degrees west. Forget the minutes. So right here is the intersection, all right? I want to park, since, since we're going west, that means we have to drag our chart to the west. Not, not this way, to the west. And 58 degrees north means we have to drag the chart north. So from this line up. So we drag it out and we make sure we hit our intersection right here. I mean, as you can see, I would drag it so it's going north, 58 degrees, and we're going northbound, and 2 degrees west, you're going west. Make sure it matches. Now, this is what I do to mark what I'm looking for. I pull out my protractor. Really simple. Um, well, before I do that, let's hover over. So the first mark is going to be at 58 degrees, 57 minutes north. Now, this thing has a little bit better of a system because you can see things a little bit clearly. So I'm going to go north. The, the numbers are going down on this particular mod, but on the green side, we're going up. So we're going up to 57 degrees. It's 55. You see those little four points on my, on my little compass here? And there's all kinds of mods for this too, if you want to change your compass. But 55, 56, 57. I'll go ahead and mark my, my first mark. I'm just going to do a random mark somewhere out here and then come down. I want, to, I want to be outside of this box because you can't really play with it until this box is removed. Anyway, my next mark is at 2 degrees, 59 minutes west. So obviously I want to go, these green, these green marks are going to the right. So I'm going to go down here, 59 minutes. Whoops, let me unpause this. 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. Awesome. Right there. Okay. So here's the cool thing about what I just did. So I marked my northerly course and my westerly, westerly course, whatever you want to call it. Let's remove the grid. Let me unpause this. And now I'm just going to make a 90 degree angle. Just bring it down, everything over here, until it hits 90 degrees. You know, now, I, I know there's this mark here. I don't, I don't want to put it on there directly. But anyway, here you go. Here I am for visual acuity. Of course, I didn't remove the mark. But here's where my 90 degrees ends up. Pretty much right here. And that's how you. That's how I mark things in on the map with the charts. Okay? I hope this helps you guys. I hope it gives you kind of an idea of how to properly do this. And uh, let me know what you thought of the video.